Then action. <laughs> Hi everyone, this is Brent. If you've had a problem with updating the firmware in your Hero 2 camera and you've tried rolling back only to end up bricking your camera, then this might be the solution for you. At the moment, the latest version of firmware is version 222. It seems to be that there's a problem that once you've updated to 222, you can't roll back to previous versions. So the actual process of rolling back bricks your camera. Let's have a look and see what I mean. Turn on the Hero 2. Everything works normally. Plug in the USB cable. And we'll go over to the computer. To roll back, you would normally reformat your SD card and then copy and paste an older version of firmware to the root level of your SD card. Please keep in mind that I'm showing you what not to do. I'm going to deliberately brick my Hero 2. If you've already done that, then it's probably because you were hoping that rolling back would fix a problem with more recent firmware. Okay, unplug USB lead. Now, the normal way to roll back the firmware in the GoPro Hero 2 is to press and hold the shutter button while powering on the camera. Then you get the video icon and you press the power button once, twice, three times. Now that will downgrade. This is the usual way that it works, but this is trying to downgrade from version 222 to version 124. We'll let that do that, but let's see what happens when it finishes. So this is what happens. You get the video icon, you get the battery indicator with a number one there. Now normally you would turn the camera on and or off and back on and it would complete the upload. In this case, it's just totally bricked at this point. This button does nothing. This button does nothing. Uh oh, problem. Uh oh, I bricked the camera. Now, if you've already done this and you're wondering what to do with your GoPro Hero 2, don't throw it away, don't send it back to GoPro. This is what you can do. Now, just check this out. If I press and hold the power button, Okay, the camera turns off, but won't turn on. No, nothing works, but it hasn't actually turned off. If I eject the SD card, what's going on? The camera is still on. If I plug that back in again, it won't recognize the SD card now. Nothing works. Okay, the only thing that you can do at this point is to take the battery out. Let the camera reset. Now, this is still not going to work. So what you need to do is plug your lead in and we need to go back and reinstall version 222 through Cineform Studio. Open Cineform Studio and turn on the Hero 2.
Okay, now this is indicated that there's a firmware update. It's showing that there's an update available. So we can go ahead and update. Okay, now that the firmware is half installed to the Hero 2, you would normally disconnect the USB lead and power on the camera. It would then continue on with the firmware update process. But we're not going to do that. Here's the solution to rolling back to a previous firmware version. We have to trick the camera into installing an earlier version of firmware. This fix was worked out by a YouTuber called Logan Gliderman and I really appreciate him agreeing to allow me to share the solution. He deserves full credit and I will put a link to his channel in the description. What you have to do is take the SD card out of the Hero 2 and put it into a card reader in your computer. Go to the root level of the SD card and delete the version 222 firmware file from the card. Then replace the deleted file with the earlier version of firmware that you wish to roll back to. Copy and paste it to the root level of the SD card. When you've done that, take the SD card out of the computer and put it back into the Hero 2. Unplug the USB lead and power on the camera to continue the update. When the firmware is finished installing, it will turn on and show the video icon. You will find that it is rolled back to whatever firmware version you copied to the card. I loaded version 124, but you can roll back to whatever version you want to. Version 124 was before Protune, but did include the Wi-Fi backpack update. You can check this by going to the submenu you will see that the Protune feature is now gone. Note that all your previous settings will have changed. Don't forget to reset them, including the time and date. If you like, another way you can check is to plug the USB lead back into the camera and go to the SD card. Open the miscellaneous file and then open the version text file. You can see here it shows version 124 successfully installed. Hopefully, this will help a few people to unbrick their Hero 2 cameras and roll back to an earlier firmware version before they were having problems. This is Bryn, thanks for watching.